Hello and welcome to another opportunity to attract the man of your dreams. Today I want to show you why you must love yourself in order to attract a man who truly loves you and in order to attract a man who's not just willing to love you but who's also able to have a loving relationship. And today I want to go a little bit against the typical dating advice because so many other dating coaches only tell you to focus on flirting techniques and to focus on the way you dress, on the way you style yourself. And yes, flirting techniques, the way you dress yourself, these things can help you. But unless you truly love yourself, you will only attract men who are not able and not willing to love you the way you deserve to be loved. And that's something that I learned the very, very hard way in my own life. The only reason why I'm now in a relationship with a woman who truly loves me and I'm able to fully love her and I am in this fulfilling relationship, the only reason why this is possible for me is because I went through a journey of self-discovery and also I went through a journey of falling in love with myself, falling in love with my non-perfect self with myself that has scars, with myself that has been through depression in the past, with myself that is now a new person. But the only way for me to become this new person was to finally realize that all the dating techniques in the world, all the flirting techniques in the world, even though they can be very helpful, are only helpful when you use them after you've built a strong foundation. And this foundation is the intensity and the way that you love yourself. You just can't build a house on ground that's floating away, on non-solid ground. It doesn't work. But that's what most dating coaches try to do when they tell you to use this line, to use this technique, to say this, to look at him this way without ever addressing the underlying self-love that you either have or you don't have. And we always attract the love that we think we deserve. And that's a painful question to ask yourself. Why have I not attracted the love of my life yet? Why am I still single? Or why am I in a relationship that's toxic? Or why have I been in relationships in the past that were anything but healthy? And I had to also ask myself this question at one point in my life. And this is true for both men and for women, but... The Get Him Keep Him podcast is a podcast for women, so I am now talking to you as a woman. But also for me as a man, I had to ask myself, why did I attract toxic relationships? Why was I not able in the past to attract a loving relationship? And the answer was very painful, but it led to a huge awakening for me. And I hope it also does the same for you right now. We attract the love we think we deserve. You might consciously say that you deserve true love because you really want it. But if the program in your subconscious mind says the opposite, then you will not attract the love that you deserve and that you want. Because your subconscious mind gets programmed from the moment you are born. Your parents, your teachers, the media, the society, the culture, the religion that you grew up with, all these things have a part or let's say have an influence on your subconscious mind. And before you uncover and overcome the trauma, the insecurities, the limiting beliefs about yourself that stop you from fully and completely loving yourself, before you go on this journey, your relationships, or let's say the relationships that you attract, won't change. And I say that to women who book Skype coaching sessions with me. So in case you book a Skype coaching session with me, I can guide you to a place where you can love yourself. I can give you exercises that allow you to love yourself and that allow you to embark on this journey of self-love. In fact, I'm currently in the process of creating a self-love audio course that you can use at home that can help you to embark on this journey of self-love, which can then eventually help you to heal your trauma. That will also be one aspect of this course and that can then help you to attract the man of your dreams, the man you truly want, the man you truly deserve, but the man you can only attract once you fully and completely love yourself. And I'm also working on a specific coaching where I can teach you in one hour in a coaching session 
different exercises, specific techniques that we can do together so that you can embark on the self-love journey, that you can feel more love for yourself. Because I believe with all my heart, and I know this from coaching amazing women, I know this from my own journey, I know this from helping so many people, and I know this from talking to so many people about their relationships, about their marriages, and also about their toxic relationships, about their breakups, about the drama that they created in their life. It's all connected with self-love, with the level of self-love that you have for yourself. And once I uncovered my subconscious beliefs and I dealt with my insecurities and I worked on overcoming my trauma and I decided that I would do whatever it takes to love myself, that's when everything changed. Because your subconscious mind holds the key to your dating success. And if your subconscious mind is conditioned to feel unworthy, to feel unloved, or to feel like you need to prove your love and to do something to receive love, to only deserve love that's conditional, not unconditional, then you have some work to do. And that's why I truly believe that the old paradigm of dating advice is obsolete. I mean, you might be saying right now, why don't you just tell me what to say on a date and give me two or three flirting techniques? Yes, flirting techniques can work. Yes, Saying certain things on a date and avoiding other things can work. But if you provide your conscious mind with flirting skills and first date techniques without first changing the hidden beliefs, the perception and ideas in your subconscious mind, that's like placing a plaster on an open wound that needs surgery. After the procedure, the plaster is helpful. But before the procedure, before the surgery, the plaster does absolutely nothing for the healing. It might even sabotage the whole process. Because unless you work on yourself and you work on the way you look at yourself, the way you think about yourself, the way you feel about yourself, unless you address these issues, you will always attract the same type of relationship. And that's something that I talk about with women who book Skype coaching sessions with me. I always like to ask about their past relationships and I ask them if they want to attract the same relationship. And of course, in 99% of the time, the woman then says to me, no, oh God, hell no, I don't want to attract the same guy again. Then you need to work on yourself. You need to work on the way you perceive yourself, the way you think about yourself, the way you talk to yourself, and the way you love yourself. I mean, I just have to think about how some of my Skype coaching clients told me that they always coincidentally or accidentally attract the same type of man, the man they do not want. The man who makes a healthy and fulfilling relationship impossible. And I truly believe, even though that might sound very brutal right now, and even though you might not want to hear it right now, but hey, I want to help you so much. I mean, my desire to help you is stronger than my desire to be liked by you. But I really want you to understand this, that it's not an accident. It's really not an accident. And I know this from my own personal experience. If you work on the way you look at yourself, the way you think about yourself, if you heal your limiting beliefs, if you heal your trauma, then I almost guarantee you, I mean, I would say I guarantee you, but for legal reasons, I'm going to say I almost guarantee you. But from my own life, I know that I can basically guarantee you that your dating life will change completely, that the quality of man that you attract will change that you can finally attract a man who's ready for a loving relationship. Because you, when you fully love yourself and your life, and as a result of loving yourself, you will love your life. Because when we feel love for ourselves, love for our bodies, love for our minds, love for our hearts, then we radiate this love energy. And as a result, we will then attract a loving relationship with a man who's not only willing to love you, but with a man who's ready to experience love and who also loves himself, who loves himself to such an extent and who loves life to such an extent and who loves you to such an extent that being in a toxic relationship is impossible, that the only way how you can live this relationship is to be in a healthy and fulfilling and loving relationship. And yes, I'm excited to soon, hopefully very soon, introduce this self-love and trauma healing audio course to you that can help you to build the foundation for your dating life, which can then allow you to attract the man of your dreams. And then, of course, on top of that, if you know how to make a man devoted to you, if you know how to make a man obsessed with you, these things are all helpful. But then once you love yourself, then these things don't work against you by you attracting the kind of man that you don't want to attract. But they work in your favor because then you have the energy, you have the self-love that allows you to attract high-quality men 
who fully love themselves and who are ready to love you. And if you want to work with me in a Skype coaching session on loving yourself, if you want me to share all kinds of different exercises with you that help me to fall in love with myself and that help me to attract a loving relationship, then you can go to gethimkeephim.com slash Skype or you can click on the second link in the description. And if you're looking for very specific flirting techniques and the specific words that you have to say in order to make a man devoted to you, then you can click on the first link in the description or go to gethimkeephim.com slash devoted, watch this video till the very end and then decide for yourself if you want to use the devotion sequence and if you want to invest in the devotion system, which is in my opinion the best program for every woman who wants to know how to make a man devoted to her. However, even if you invest in this program, you have to love yourself in order to attract the man that you truly want, the man of your dreams. And by the way, if you decide to invest in the devotion sequence, if you decide to click on the first link in the description or you go to gethimkeephim.com slash devoted, you can then send a screenshot of your order received to sebastian at gethimkeephim.com and I will then give you a 50 euro discount code for your very first Skype coaching session with me. This is also valid for all the other products that you buy through my links. If you buy any of these products and you then send a screenshot of your order received to sebastian at gethimkeephim.com, I will give you a 50 euro discount code for your very first Skype coaching session. So in other words, the discount code that you get for your first Skype coaching session with me is worth more than the price that you actually have to pay when you invest in one of these products. So I think that's a very good deal. And if you then want to work with me, then I'm very excited to guide you to a place where you can finally love yourself and attract the loving relationship that you've always wanted and that you truly deserve. And if you enjoyed watching this video, if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up and leave a comment in the comment section below. Share your opinion, share your thoughts. I would love to hear from you. And I would love it even more if you would hit the subscribe button and smash that notification bell so that you get notified whenever I release a new video for you. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video.